Ciao guys, I'm Fudier, so the Oculus TV app was just released yesterday and of course, so with that, you can use a lot of streaming app and stuff and just watch the TV how you will do in your uh, living room in the Oculus Go, but somebody uh, find out something that we can do also and it's much, much more interesting than just watching TV. So let's get to it and let's see how to install the flat apps for Android on the Oculus Go and if we don't find it, how to find it and also how to uninstall them. But first, thanks so much for watching. If you're new from the channel, feel free to check out all the other videos in the channel and if you like what you see and want to keep an update about VR and tech in general just click or tap the subscribe button so you don't miss anything but let's go back in topic and let's see together how to do it from the beginning of course we're gonna need this guide over here to upload the app on the oculus go and then for the uninstall and everything I'm gonna show you in a second let's go and here we are on the computer so let's see how to do it it's super easy because if you know the guide you know exactly how to sideload the apps uh, what I want to show you is the apps that I'm actually side loading right now and the first one is ES File Explorer I already downloaded the APK you can find it on internet like very very easy like you just write ES File Explorer APK and pretty much you're gonna find everything you need even from that website directly certification error no worries and uh, when you download that, uh, rename it to have a, a very easy name as we did in the first time that we opened the comment prompt and we connect, of course, our Oculus Go that I just disconnected to show you. So we connect our Oculus Go and for some people that had problem before, uh, when it's connected, if it doesn't show up, uh, we have to do CD and then we use like our ADB because sometimes it's better to do it before so you can recognize it and then after that like ADB devices and so it's gonna read all the devices at that point we can do ADB install and install like our apps like the file explorer apk we can also just copy and paste from here that's a good thing about the new command prompt and uh, missing apk file because i already installed it anyway and there's a slash over here and also what i installed is steam link apk that works perfectly and we're gonna see it together so uh, why did we install es file explorer actually because uh, sometimes it's, uh, it's very long to like just get in the computer to uninstall uh, stuff from uh, ADB so we can do it directly there we don't need an ADB anymore to uninstall the APK so let's get to the Oculus Go I'm not gonna be able to show you the recorded inside with the recorder or with the streaming because it just doesn't work for some reason uh, of course because the Oculus TV may be uh, they're blocking for of course don't share content uh, but probably I can show it like this so let's see if it works okay and here we are inside the oculus go so we have to go on the oculus tv app there was a recent one of course in my case and we click on it at this point we wait just to load and what we're gonna have here is the oculus app I can't really move the oculus because uh, I have the camera in the lens and when we scroll down we're gonna find unknown sources and of course we're gonna find our app that we just side loaded so as you can see you can download steam link and just go inside and start to stream your computer directly inside And as you can see, we can just play all our Steam games too in a super, super easy way. But let's see now, going back, how to uninstall the apps from the Oculus Go. So we can go back and we have to open again Oculus TV. At this point, we go down and we open our second app that was Easy File Explorer. We tap on it and we're gonna go through all the installation. We can just scroll down and go on App. And here we're gonna be able to see all the app and if we keep clicking on here we can uninstall the app without going through ADB anymore and it's super super easy we can also use it just as a file browser and to go around in all our folders and this gives for sure even more potential to the oculus go and the ability to install all these apps make it 
really one of the most interesting piece of technology for the low price gonna be able to stream different games with steam link app or all the other different app let me know the app would you are installing anyway guys if you like the video like if you didn't like the video dislike let me know in the comment below what you think about it and the app you are installing and subscribe to the channel for more about vr and tech in general see you guys in the next video ciao